What's going on YouTube? Adam Ryan Clark. Just getting back from the beach, guys. Nice and relaxed. Had a great time. Figured what a better time than to get home and do a harvest and show you guys what I got and show you a uh, um, show you my seed collection I've got started for next year. I want I'm going to grow and uh, I'm dehydrating some peppers. So if you guys hear some a little bit of wind noise in the back, that's probably what it is. Is a dehydrator. Uh, first of all. I want you guys to all go to this gentleman's YouTube channel right here. YouTube.com forward slash B E M A N C O D. That's again B Man C O D at YouTube. Um, I sent him a about six butch tea peppers, and this kid has never ate anything hot in his life. Um, go check his channel out. It's the first video he's ever uploaded. This kid ate a whole pod, um, and it tore him up. Um, go check his channel out again. That's B E E M A N C O D um, on YouTube. Uh, good kid, um, and you, it's fun. It's a good video. You'll get a good laugh out of it. Let me go ahead and show you guys this. Here's my harvest, guys. This is just from today. Um, there's got to be over 100 pods there. Has to be. Uh, that's off of three plants. Um, my one of my smaller plants still got a bunch of green pods not really changing color yet but it will catch up um, but this thing is I mean, these are massive looking um, this is why I almost think that the things are cross but everybody keeps telling me butch teas do funny things so I mean you know there's a regular butch tea um, but yeah it was a really good harvest um, actually a couple of my plants blew over while I was gone uh, believe it or not in the five gallon buckets um, the I guess the soil just got dry and we've had some really high winds here in Asheville and it blew two of them over didn't hurt anything at all uh, good thing I had them staked up uh, let me show you guys my seed collection uh, this is going to be for next year's season um, all the stuff that's in black writing is from T-Motor um, this is some stuff that he was generous enough to send to me that I really want to grow next year um, next year I'm growing a lot of different strains and I'm I'm trying to get really into the the phenotypes of stuff you know trying to get that that perfect plant that produces the perfect pods um, is it feasible I don't know hopefully so um, gonna be growing some red savinas dadles white habaneros red habaneros and orange habaneros those um, right there are from uh, one million scoville club I don't think he actually has a YouTube channel anymore um, I think he actually closed it down again and the black writing is from T-Motor, 7 pot Jonah, 7 pot Primo, Brain Strain, Naga Cross with a 7 pot and a yellow uh, 7 pot. These are from Naga Canaria, um, I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, hot Shot, Vulcan F1s, Red Hot F1s. Uh, this is from um, Come on now, Freestyle Rolla, the Trinidad Perfume, and then this is actually from one of my pods. Um, this is my perfect biggest pod that I've had so far. I harvested just for seed. Um, and then here's for the people that want seeds. Um, I'm going to be shipping out uh, this Friday. Um, there's probably a thousand seeds in this thing, if not, you know, a little more. I have like three more bags this full of Butch Tea Seeds also. And then these are for my wife, uh, Concord grapes and Muscadine grapes. If you guys have never tried either one of those grapes, man, they're fantastic. And then I got some more over here that are drying in that cup. And uh, got uh, another butch teapot there. Took and cut the seeds out and then dry out. Um, while I was at the beach, I bought a dehydrator. This is actually a dehydrator for, um, you can dehydrate pods in it, but it doesn't kill the seeds. So, I mean, it actually goes to like 95 degrees. Um, I forget how many hours it is. I set a timer on it. But I've probably got 60 pods in there. I just started it half an hour ago. So I'm going to try it out and see um, see how it does. At the worst, at least I'll have some good powder. Um, I might try to ship out some powder to some of you guys out there that have been subscribed to me for a long time that maybe want to try some. But just wanted to show you guys um, my little seed selection for next year. I've actually got from Freestyle Roller also um, some original brain strain um, seeds and um, 
couple other different seeds that he sent me, or actually there there were pods that I harvested the seeds out of. And the other thing that I'm making that I've actually tried it is extremely hot. Guys, this is Butch Tea Vodka. Um, there's probably 10 pods in there. I took a, some uh, just smearing off 100 proof vodka and put about, I don't know, 8 or 10 pods in there. It's been sitting for a month. And let me tell you guys, it's ridiculously stupid hot. Um, I'm actually going to save that for Halloween. A friend of mine every year throws a Halloween party. And uh, we're going to see who's man enough to try some. But just wanted to show you guys the harvest. Uh, the plants are doing good. Um, the pods are doing good. I've got some damn pods now that I don't know what to do with. But, well guys, I'm going to hop off here and run and get ready to head to bed and start the work week back next week. Again, guys, check out B-Man COD and check out his video of him eating a, but a butch tea. Also, uh, Ted Barris, Ted the Fire Breathing Idiot, will be doing a review on my butch teas uh, probably this week. So keep an eye out on his channel. Um, let's see, who else? Um, Rivet Gardener is supposed to be either cooking with mine or... He's going to grow them. I'm not sure what exactly what he had planned. Um, and the Italian 556 is swapping some pods with me. Uh, he's going to review mine, and I'm going to review his. So, uh, guys, I appreciate all the subscribers. Also, forgot to mention, guys, I reached my 100 subscriber mark. Um, I really appreciate them at like 105. Uh, it's took a long time to get to that. I know that's not a whole lot of people, but uh, to me, that's for somebody that was just uploading, uploading videos on pepper plants. I feel like that's a, a damn good number that I've reached. Um, hopefully we'll reach 200 and maybe 1,000 one day. Who knows? Uh, I promised you guys I would do something crazy uh, when I hit 100. So uh, I guess I'm going to have to put my money where my mouth is and, and eat some pods or something. Uh, maybe leave me a comment and tell me something crazy I can do. I'm not rubbing nothing in my eyes. I'm not rubbing any peppers in my eyes or anything. But I'll eat a pod or something. Uh, I keep saying I need to do reviews. So... No, no better time than now, huh? All right, guys. I appreciate it. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. See you, bye.